Hi, I'm Nancy, and welcome to my kitchen. Today I'm making basil pesto with spaghetti. So let's get started. Okay, so let's uh, review the ingredients. I have basil leaves, olive oil, freshly grated uh, Parmesan cheese, salt, pepper, this is toasted pine nuts, garlic cloves, and thick spaghetti pasta. Okay, so here I have a, a pot of water uh, that's boiling, and what I'm gonna do is blanch the basil leaves for 10 seconds. And what this does is help retain the brightness of the leaves. I'm putting the basil leaves in the ice bath. What I'm also going to do is to blanch the garlic very quickly. And what this does is it helps soften the bite of the raw garlic. That's it. We'll also put in the ice bath. Okay, so let's start making a sauce. I have a small uh, processor here. I'm adding the garlic, the pine nuts, the basil leaves, We'll give it a quick twirl. And what you can also do is scrape down the sides in between pulses. Enough. I'm going to add the cheese. So next I'm going to slowly drizzle the olive oil while the food processor is still going on. Don't add too much salt. There's enough salt in the cheese. That's really good. Okay. So that's done. So next we're going to uh, boil the pasta. Okay, I have the same uh, pot of water boiling. So I'm going to add some salt before I throw in the pasta. Throwing in the whole pound. And cook that till it's uh, al dente. So the best way to cook pasta al dente is to boil it for one minute less than the suggested time. So on this box it says 11 minutes, so I'm gonna let it cook for 10 minutes. Okay, the pasta is done. 10 minutes is up, I'm gonna turn the flame off and we can plate this. Okay, so let's uh, mix up the pasta. You can see the pesto sauce is nice and vibrant green. It looks really yummy. I'm going to place a couple spoonfuls at the bottom. Add the noodles. Water here. Another couple of spoons in there. And mix it up. And here it is. Pesto pasta cheese here and that looks absolutely delicious and it, and it didn't really take too long to make and here we have basil pesto with spaghetti 
The pesto is bright green and it tastes every bit as fresh as when it's made with raw basil. It's really hard to mess this up and it's all a matter of personal taste. Just go ahead and adjust it to your own liking. If you like more garlic, add more garlic. If you like more cheese, add more cheese. That's the beauty of cooking at home. I remember the first time I had a pesto sauce. It was in the place in North Beach in San Francisco and it was called a U.S. restaurant. And I believe it was at the corner of Columbus and Stockton Street. And the place was always busy on the weekends, Friday, Saturday nights. Uh, there were lines out the door. And once I tried the pesto sauce there, I was hooked. I've been eating pesto ever since, and I love it. And I hope you enjoy this. Okay, let's see if uh, Shadow likes pesto as much as I do. Oh, it's like Lady and the Tramp. She likes it. Thank you for watching everyone. Eat well and be healthy. See you next time.